Yep, it's another video with the moon in it to start. It's Monday, 16th of January 2012, and it's about 25 to 7. And it's the week off for CES. And I need to talk to Go Daddy. I'm not again so come out, but it's a spread over on this site. I'm not the only one who installed the front page extensions, and I know front page, but still what I've got so uh, the cash point's broken in bedwars so uh, I could select Duke Tower on the way into Caerphilly and uh, I think Barry and uh, it's uh, plus 0 0.5 degrees Celsius at the moment so I'm thinking an emergency full English and a cappuccino and a crown produce and twit. Hello Mr. Lambdeg. Yeah, um, I've decided against the bucket and spade. It is somewhat chilly. That's the other window. Anyway, um, I go over the bridge. And there's a breeze. It's cold. Okay. The salmon, as I think I'll probably now call it. Some cats, they are. And later, ten past nine later, so far, a large cappuccino. A pint of cranberry juice, a pint of orange juice, a large full English, um, all of Twit. Now on the Birch Cast Day Zero, and Kintabari, and I'm on Romney Ale. This is King's Ale, 4.7% alcohol by volume. They were from Dallas, I think they now moved to Blenavon. Not sure why, but there you go. Mm. <coughs> Fruity and bitter. That's nice. That's an easily a B plus. And number two. And they went sure behind the bar. They might be off. But it is okay. Um, white score. UB Wick with a Y. 4.8% alcohol by volume. Maybe it is just cloudy. Mm. Actually, nice um, citrusy lemon bitter aftertaste. A bit creamy. That's a B plus. Not a B plus. Number three. And fortunately, the Adelson's cloudy cider is off. So I'm off to Kent. This is late ride. That is by Shepherd Neem. A Kentish ale. 4.5% alcohol by volume. In the meantime, I've downloaded and tapped. Ooh, this is cold. Creamy. Full body. Mm. That's easily a B. Plus. Well, slightly heavy, but not in a bad way. Okay, this is number four, and it's my last. And it's Wandering Beacons at the Brecon Room Company. 5% alcohol by volume. Dark ale, looks like a creamy head. <laughs> and I'm going to go to sleep. Yep, back on the case. Oh, very creamy. Slightly chocolatey, bitterish, burnt aftertaste. That's a B plus as well. Hey, four straight B pluses. Yeah, 